Hello everyone, my name is Jeremiah Dexter, tuning in to you as JD Gaming. And tonight, we are going to be playing a game called Contempt. I know nothing about this game. I did get this game off of itch.io. I can leave it in the description when this goes up on the channel. If you guys want to play it for yourselves and not watch the video, that's that's fine and dandy. But today's game, or tonight's game, is Contempt. And uh, like I said, I go into these games blind. And since it is spooktober, but it's almost over, this is going to be going up as, you know, possibly by Halloween. I'm not sure. But, uh, <laughs> it looks incredible. It looks like it's going to run not so well, but we'll see. Anyway, I guess we'll get into the game. I love the intro music, too. Okay, new game. We're going in. Content loading. Okay. Ooh. Oh, we are in it now. Ooh. Oh, it actually runs pretty good. For being such a game from Unreal Engine, and it runs pretty well on my Windows XP desktop. Okay, and I guess we go to the house. Look at the out-of-place leaves. Ooh, it is lagging, though. The sound. Hello? Can I go in? Oh, no. Is there a brightness option? There we go. Now it should run smoother. Yeah. I turn the brightness up. I turn the shadows down. Oh, I guess we go over here. Is that that's a scythe? Ooh. Uh, oh, there's just a key sitting here? E to interact. I just took the key. Can I interact with anything else? No? Not even the hedge clipper? Oh, come on. You gotta clip some hedges. Oh, can I run? No. I can't. Is there anything else around back? Nope. There's nothing around there. Windows? So far, this game is... Cool. Just close that for good measures. Yeah, go right through the door. Uh, still open, surprisingly. Will I be able to make it out, though? What's this? can't read it. Can I? Yeah, uh, that's... Not interactable. The stores don't have anything about you. Hello? No? Hi, miss. Oh! Cool telephone! Hmm. Does the light work? Nothing works. Well, of course, it's an abandoned house. Nothing's gonna work. Light switch. Oh. Click E. It says E to interact. Oh, where do I want to go first? Kitchen. Basement. Upstairs. Ugh. Oh. Oh, thank goodness the basement's locked. Basements. I don't know in horror games which is worse, basements or attics. To me, attics are worse. Oh, K. 
Okay, there was just a kitchen knife there. What was that? Oh, freaking clock. If I could interact with that clock, I'd knock it off the wall. Can I interact with the fridge? No, I want to see what home goods grandma made oh, yeah, made me. Made me. But grandmama is not here. Okay, every single door in this place is locked. That's a big hazard. It's like wardrobe says, oh, I don't want to go in here. I'm sorry if the game has little skip sounds in it. Yeah, I like what you're hearing right now. I'm sorry, but it's the computer I own. I found the bathroom. It's cockroaches everywhere, newspapers. Who leaves trash bags in the shower? the bathtub I don't know I don't own a bathtub I own a shower where I'm at open open no nothing's interactable what why are the moths buzzing or flying around that light it's not even on newspaper under books okay I guess we just go upstairs now No, no, no. Oh my god. Go, go, go. I can't. I can't go. No. Oh, no. What just happened? Go. I can't go upstairs. Oh, it waited for that moment. Oh. My flashlight don't work. Uh. The lights are on somehow. Uh. Oh. No. 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 Oh. That's not even a jump scare. I just... The lights turned off. I got really scared that I heard the laugh, and then all of a sudden they flicked back on, and the flicker of them scared me. I thought I was going to get jump scared. And I go up the stairs. That was not open. I'm not going in there. That was a weird sound. I can't go upstairs. My flashlight looking. Yes. Hello? Not an interactable door. Hello? Let's see for sure. There. That switch is going to be right. Oh, this door is interactable. And it's locked. I think that's the last door up here. Oh, I didn't go this way, did I? Another telephone. Oh. Okay, why is this the There's only- There's aching deep inside that no longer I can hide, and it's telling me once more it's time to roam. Excuse me? But I cannot tell when I'll be coming home. Correct order. Very well. See, there's the North Star guiding me, and a light on the horizon showing where I long to be. I travel on. Is that it? That's it. Why is this the only untouched spot in the house? Oh, that is a chink. Like the rest of the house looks abandoned and everything, but this spot looks like a nice sitting area. Look, we're like grumpy grampy could sit there in that chair, grab a book and start reading. I put a TV up here. 
instead of the phone ringing off the hook, instead of radio. Oh, I what? Oh. Okay. I can examine. What was that? Okay, I was completely distracted by the radio. What the heck was that? Oh. Okay. Oh. That just leads back out here. It's still not open. Okay, I'll go back this way. I think there's like one more. A closet? <laughs> Cozy little closet. No. What? What? What's going on? No. Oh. No, no, no. Okay. This game is getting scary already. Well, that's an old desk lamp. I mean, I got a 1980s desk lamp right here, but it's not as old as that. Man. I also kind of got somewhat a similar phone to that, but mine's red. Do these drawers open? Nah, I can't even go back there. That chair. You'd expect further to be like physics in this game. But no, chairs don't even move. Okay, I'll go down to this whatever room. Is it the living room? Please stop glitching. The broken ceiling fan. Okay, that just leads to the kitchen. Record player! What's that record? Oh. Is that the Bee Gees? Robin Gibb? Saved by the Bell? Robin Zane? My favorite Robin Gibb album. Uh, no wait, my favorite Robin Gibb album. Some slowly sisters. Okay, that's the same as that lady again, but who's that guy? Ooh, cassette tape. I can't interact with it. Ugh. You know, those woods or whatever forest that is, whatever it is, it gives me reminds me of my dreams like some dream I have where I'm like being chased by some sort of girl in some red cloak like and it's like medieval times or whatever but to me I call it I call her red riding hood but in the dream I look dead and everything she looks dead but it's like I can't see her face and uh, like everything is pale storm clouds it's like raining there's no color on anything except for the leaves in the trees and the leaves on the ground, which is like bright red, like glowing red. I don't know. Every time I see, oh, the TV changed. I don't know. The broken chair. But every time I see something like that, it gives me vibes of that dream and reminds me of it. 
What do we have here? Cassettes? VCRs. Why are TVs always on channel 3? I played a game recently called Visage, I think is what it's called. On a stream, and uh, that TV in the game was on a channel 3. And it's like the same kind of TV. It's a tube TV. Oh, that's a cabinet. Windows are all boarded up. Ugh. Okay, was there a reason to come in here? Can I crouch? Can't crouch. What are you looking at? Okay, I'm gonna go. Oh, that's the ball upstairs. Okay, it's not the phone. Oh, it. Why would the phone be in the bathroom? I wish you could run. Hello? What? Is that you? What was that? Heard a noise. Was it this closet? This wasn't open before. Um. Do I? What do I do here? Light switch? No. Oh. Why is this interactable? This was not open before. Oh. The attic's open. What's that sound? Who's walking around? There's someone in here. You hear that creaking? There's someone walking around. What? What's wrong with my flashlight? <laughs> oh. Munching on something. Oh no. Hello. Huh? Oh! Oh my! Huh? Oh! Oh my God! Oh my! Okay, what's going on? Oh! What? What? So long story short, this girl's ghost haunts this house. 
Was it left abandoned because she hung herself? Oh, why do games have to end like that? Why do... Okay. Disclaimer. To anybody who has, like, very deep depression. If you're having negative thoughts or anything, please reach out to someone. Reach out to help immediately. Anyway... That was content, and, uh, yeah, scary game. I loved it until the bitter end, but, uh, as always, don't consider subscribing. Subscribe on your own time whenever you want to because you're not forced to do anything here. What I do is for entertainment, it gives you guys something to watch because I like doing it because it's always good to try something new as of me doing music all the time. Gaming videos, reaction videos are good as well. And I'm also going to be uploading a lot of remasters from the Hex Girls. That because I want to do that. But uh, I don't do it for the subs, likes, comments, reviews. I just do it because I like doing it just to get it out there. Anyway, that was content. And if you guys want to play it, like I said, it's in the description below. If you want to download it for yourselves. If you don't want to watch, just give it a play. And I mean, you don't have to do anything. Like I said, you're free here on the channel. Anyway. As always, I'm your Canadian Ginger J. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Hasta la bye-bye.